The Rocky Mountain Batland Bears came into this season with a brand new head coach and some high expectations after finishing 8-4 last season and earning an appearance in the NAIA playoffs. In the first game of the season, they pulled off an upset on the road against number 9 Dickinson State, followed by a huge home opener win against Montana Northern. Since then, the Batland Bears have dropped three games in a row, totaling 14 points through those games. Rocky had a bye last week, which couldn't have come at a better time for Coach Studstream's squad, giving them an opportunity to refocus and work on the things that needed improving after three losses in a row. It was great. We uh, got back to the basics. We focused on us, didn't look a, a lick at Southern Oregon. Uh, really got back to what we needed to do, uh, playing aggressively, uh, up-tempo, tackling well, uh, really focused on us. Having blowout losses three weeks in a row can affect a team in a variety of negative ways and be hard to bounce back from. That's where a good head coach shines and proves he can keep his team motivated and focused on the task at hand, winning ball games. Studstream also took the bye week as an opportunity to remind his players the talent they have and the type of team they can be regardless of their record halfway through the season. Guys, every week's crazy. You know, it's different in this league, and every week you got to bring it. Um, you know, we're 2-3. and three. We're not 0-5. We're not 1-4. and four. We're 2-3. and three. We've beaten good teams. Um, and, you know, staying positive with each other uh, as well as believing in what we're doing with the coaches, with our schemes. Um, and we did some things with, you know, uh, getting the players around each other a little bit more getting around different people, um, and tried to build that chemistry back up again. Corp on the keeper, Drew Corp is in for six for the Madeline Bear. Thank you.